A mother panics as her eight-year-old daughter, who is nonverbal, is put on the wrong bus with no idea where she might be. The mom says she couldn't help but think the worst. On Monday, Lacey Moore put her daughter on a bus for the first day of a summer program at Mike Davis Elementary. But when it was time for the bus to drop her back off, Moore's daughter Tiffany was nowhere to be found. Wink News reporter Michelle Alvarez is live for us. Michelle, how'd she end up on the wrong bus? Yeah, the teacher thought little Tiffany was a different child and put her on the wrong bus. The Collier County Sheriff's Office report goes on to say that Collier County Schools told the mom her child was never missing, but Lacey Moore told me that's just not true. Lacey Moore is a mom who says it's hard to rest. Not that she's complaining, she loves her eight-year-old little girl, but Tiffany is on the autism spectrum, is nonverbal, has the mentality of a three-year-old, and likes to wander off. Monday was Tiffany's first day of summer school at Mike Davis Elementary in Collier County. But when the time came for Tiffany to get on the bus to go home, she was not put on it. She was due to get off the bus at 1.28 p.m. I went downstairs at 1.20 and I have the bus tracking app, so I was following it and I knew the bus was late. Around 2.30, the bus she put her daughter on in the morning pulled in and dropped another child off and that's when she realized something was wrong. The bus driver saw me standing out there. So he opened the window and said, are you waiting on Tiffany? And I said, yeah. And um, he said, they never put her on my bus. So Moore called the school, then 911. The Collier County Sheriff's Office report says being the first day of school for special needs kids, attendance was done on paper instead of focus, so teachers did not have access to the photos of students. Turns out the whole day the teacher thought Tiffany was a different child and put her on the wrong bus. Moore told me for more than two hours, she could only imagine the worst. I, I just thought that they were going to find her in a canal somewhere that she wandered off. I, I just, I didn't know where my daughter was and it, it was scary. Eventually, deputies were able to find the bus that Tiffany was on, and according to the sheriff's office report, the driver pulled over right here and waited for mom to reunite with her daughter. Now, Collier County Schools also said in a statement, it's important to note that the child was safe and was supervised the entire time. That may be, but mother told me she was terrified. For now, reporting live in Collier County, Michelle Alvarez, Wink News.